Good day, uh, uh, friends, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I'm Mahmoud from University of Tehran, and uh, I'm presenting this paper, Integration of GIS, uh, Shown Entropy, and Multi-Criteria Decision Making for Hospital Site Selection. This paper is uh, co-authored with uh, my uh, MSc student, uh, Iman Zandi, and myself. Uh, actually, the problem is that uh, most of the time in our daily decision making, we are dealing with uh, a number of different criteria. Some of them are supporting of our, of our idea, some of them are not. But the decisions are an integration of these uh, criteria with different con uh, constraints and conditions. And uh, we have used GIS as a science and technology of integrating data and uh, considering the Sharon entropy as a measure of uncertainty in this decision making. Our case study is a hospital site selection in Tehran. Uh, as an introduction, uh, I can say that uh, the increasing number of urban population, aging populations, urban development, increasing the land values, high cost of the land, distribution of the hospitals, and also a special equity and special access is very important, especially now, nowadays, because we are dealing with uh, COVID-19 and uh, there are a number of uh, issues that uh, people are asking, uh, where, the, uh, where is the best uh, hospital to reach? What is the cost involved? What are the accessibility? What are the equipment and exper uh, expertise? And this is a very good example of multi-criteria decision-making. Therefore, the necessity of locating the new hospitals and hospital site selection is one of the uh, very good uh, GIS questions uh, now we are dealing with in this research. Based on the uh, previous research undertaken uh, using combination of different techniques like uh, topsis, fuzzy logic, um, AHP algorithms, integration of GIS and fuzzy, and also combination of uh, article uh, network process, WIC or IDAS. There are different uh, research undertaken in the hospital site selection, some of them in, Tehran, in Iran, some of them overseas. Uh, in this research, we have uh, selected uh, District 5 in mega city of Tehran, capital of Iran, uh, because it is the second largest district in Tehran. Uh, it's a very big district, uh, highly populated, and there are shortage of hospitals in nearby areas. The special distribution of hospitals is very important. Uh, access of the citizens is one of the parameters we have uh, considered. And also, it is a very complex and difficult decision making because so many uh, economical, technical, social um, issues are involved in this site selection process. However, traditional methods uh, to assess or to evaluate the position of the hospitals um, is impossible at the moment or very difficult because uh, people would like to have uh, cost functions in their decision making, equipments, expertise, uh, social uh, values. There are different uh, important factors which we need an optimization of the program. And therefore, it is a multi criteria decision making in order to consider all these. Uh, heterogeneous uh, parameters we are involved with. Uh, the problem we have, most of the employee criteria in hospital site selections uh, are special. There are shortage of data or uh, reliable data for this or up-to-date data. GIS is useful for special decision making and visualization and the management of a number of data because uh, Somehow we are dealing with a big data issue because, uh, for example, Tehran at the moment, we have uh, something about more than 10 million population during the day or 10 to 12 million. And uh, this is a mega city. 
and uh, the distribution of the hospitals and health cares are very important uh, in, among the different services. Uh, GIS is used as a multi-criteria decision making and its importance is getting more. In previous research, uh, debating approaches in decision making are very mostly subjective and uh, we are dealing with some objective criteria and uh, we are interested to weight uh, different parameters based on some sensitivity analysis in order to investigate what uh, parameters are involved what are the most important parameters, what are the least cost value parameters uh, and most effective parameters. Uh, therefore, we are going to give some weights for this and uh, perform this optimization problem. The research objectives and hypothesis, uh, the main aim of this uh, is to combine different uh, mechanisms, including GIS, entropy, and TOPSIS method for this decision making in order to uh, have the site selection, optimum site selection of the hospital in District 5 of Tehran. The hypothesis of the research is that the combination of this objective weighting approach, GIS, uh, and multi-criteria and entropy can uh, assist in a more accurate determination of the new hospitals and also um, we find an objective weighting functions. This graph uh, presents the methodology of the research. Uh, I have to make it small, smaller so that you can see. Uh, based on this uh, methodology, we have considered the different layers, including land use layer, population layers, roads, uh, and also vulnerability uh, about the vulnerability value, and also the candidate sites uh, for this, especially we consider seismic vulnerability assessment because Tehran is one of the areas which is a very uh, earthquake uh, prone area. And um, the uh, temporal durations uh, of the earthquake is estimated as uh, 150 years return period. And uh, uh, we have not uh, earthquake more than six Richter uh, during the last 185 years in Tehran. And uh, it is highly uh, susceptible uh, issue that uh, we may have a strong earthquake in Tehran. Therefore, we consider the seismic vulnerability in this uh, area. Uh, the decision so making. You your two minute warning. Two minutes, okay. Two minutes, yeah. Okay. Then uh, this, we consider this uh, criteria, decision criteria, and then uh, cross reference the alternatives and the criteria. And we use the shine uh, entropy in order to uh, assess the accuracy of the work. And then uh, the output of this Shannon theory. Uh, has been entered into the topsis in order to find out the nearest and far, uh, far most uh, parameters with respect to the ideal. The research scenario will provide the most important criteria for hospital site selection, preparation of a special data layer, candidate sites, extract information based on the criteria of the site and calculate the weight based on the Sharon theory weighting. Uh, then uh, ranking of the candidate using the TOPSIS method and uh, based on the integration of that, uh, provide the analysis of the result. The methodology is based on the Sean theory as an objective function method, uh, which gives the probability distribution of the employed criteria. We have also used TOPSIS uh, in order to find out the distance to the least distance from the positive ideal solution and the negative uh, ideal solutions. For implementation of the plan, uh, we have considered the District 5 of Tehran. This area is uh, uh, 54 square kilometers with uh, 850,000 population. Uh, you can see the District 5 in Tehran. Uh, the decision criteria layers have been used as a land use maps uh, collected from municipality of Tehran and also 
for earthquake, we have used the seismic alternative map we have uh, produced in other in other research uh, with Mr. Sheikhian. We have used the open street map for the road access. And uh, for implementation, the integration of round theory and top sys is used in order to calculate the weights of the criteria. And we have used the Python language and uh, top sys uh, as a function of integration. The results of the Shannon theory will give us each criteria. We have considered uh, 12 criteria with their respective weights. And also in the Topsis method, we have uh, used an integration of the Topsis and Shannon theory in order to rank different criteria on different sites. We have considered uh, 10 different sites. This is the result of the Topsis in order to find out the uh, candidate sites and the integration of Shawn theory and topsis. Uh, in this, uh, sh in the left, we have the candidate sites and the, in the right side, we have the integration of Shawn theory and topsis ranking method. For the conclusion, uh, we have a large number of uh, criteria to consider. We have to uh, limit those criteria and select the most uh, probable one, most influencing one. In this uh, study, we have con uh, combined the objective functions, uh, weighting function from uh, using GIS in order to locate the new hospitals. And also we have used Shannon theory in order to assist the uncertainty of the criteria and weight of the criteria and uh, using uh, experts' opinion. And based on the uh, Shannon theory and the criteria has been weighted. Uh, in previous study, most of the uh, decision making were based on the uh, some subjective weighting method. We have tried to have the objective weighting method, and depending on the uh, selected criteria, we have uh, changed the criteria in order to find out the best uh, weight for every uh, parameter. And also, Topsys has used has shown us the sites number six, uh, ten, and three are most uh, suitable for this study. Uh, due to the location of the existing hospitals, we have ranked the different alternatives and uh, site number uh, three uh, was one of the sites considered for this. Com combining the objective function methods and multi-criteria provide a good solution for optimum site selection and also Sean theory provided some, uh, although it is a data driving method, uh, what provided uh, us opportunity to have more accurate results with respect to the uh, previous research. In future, we are uh, suggesting that uh, some objective uh, weighting methods should be compared with other methods like AHP, which is the simplest data integration method. But uh, there are a number of other most uh, complicated methods like uh, granular computing, rough set theory, uh, integration of fuzzy and rough set theory, which we have used in earthquake uh, volume assessment, uh, but uh, using these different data fusion approaches will provide some opportunity, but uh, we have to take care because uh, all of them has some restrictions and some capabilities. Uh, in this research, uh, this is uh, all for my uh, presentation and uh, uh, I'm here for any questions uh, from the audience. Thank you very much for your uh, patience. I had a, a quick question about, um, you talked about sort of using the Tobis method for looking for the ideal solution. And I wondered if you could tell us a little bit maybe about the, the trade-offs um, with that method and, um, in terms of looking for like an ideal solution um, or finding a solution that's sort of the closest um, to that ideal. Yes, um, actually, the, um, this is um, we have concern from mathematical point of view, but there are different approaches. For example, environmental problems, legal problems. In order to access, for example, uh, we have now some traffic limitations during the day in some part of the Tehran. Uh, these uh, parameters have not been taken into account, legal aspect or traffic limitations. But uh, within the data we have used, uh, we have considered the land use data, access, uh, road access, and also vulnerability population and existing hospitals. 
but uh, we tried to restrict ourselves with this data we had. Uh, but in reality, we have much more uh, situations and conditions to, in order to take into account uh, in reality.